Well, this time of year, it seems like everyone is getting sick. Yeah. And most oftentimes, we blame the cold. So in today's Who Knew, Sarah Grimmer breaks down that myth. Didn't your mother always tell you, wear a coat, you'll catch a cold? Well, guess what? Doctors say she's wrong. Cold weather doesn't give you a cold. The doctor that's calling out your mom in this case? Well, what I found is that half the things your mother tells you are wrong, and one of them is that the cold gives you a cold. Dr. Dan McGee, a pediatric hospitalist at Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. He's calling out the old coats and colds wives' tale. Oh, preparing to go to school was like getting ready for extended deep sea diving. We do see more colds in the winter months, and that's because we're all inside, closed in, with the windows closed, doors closed, coughing and sneezing on each other. Also, during the cold weather, the air is drier and colder, and that means your skin will crack, the lining of your nose will crack, and that makes it more susceptible for viruses to enter. Colds are caused by viruses. Once you're sick, you get other people sick. <laughs> that is how colds are contracted. Layers upon layers of clothing outside won't prevent that. I can't put my arms out! <laughs> Obviously, if you're outside too long without a coat on, you can risk suffering from hypothermia. But you probably won't get a cold. And not only that, you don't have to dry your hair before you go outside. That's not going to give you pneumonia. No pneumonia, but there are still some concerns. I think the best way to think about dressing for a cold winter day is dress in as many clothes as you feel comfortable. Obviously, if the wind is blowing and it's cold outside, you want to cover up and make sure you don't have any bare, exposed skin. Because although you won't get a cold, you may run the risk of getting frostbite. So no, coats don't prevent colds. Who knew? But still. Do bundle up. It's awfully cold outside. I'm Sarah Grimmer for Fox 17 News.